That's what you deserve. as much as you oh <laughs> no no don't worry about this actually well, take some take a couple of packs take a few oh thank you what are all the cigarettes for are you heading on a long journey or something <coughs> no, no 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 nothing like that at all i'm just interested in the cards okay the cigarette cards oh you got any yeah well get them out let me take a look come on come on a little picture card yeah i'll pay you a good price okay here ah nothing i haven't got the value is in completing the set Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. Well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the amount of money. <laughs> A veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah. You know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. And you'd pay me. A fair price. Now, you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Rampart, at your service. I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. A new challenge. Why not? Cartophilist and Ephemera Collector. Okay. We do have a couple of cards so far. But we're gonna work on that later on. Yeah. Let's go see Javier Escuela now and see what he's up to. Oh, we got a new stranger up here. I just don't understand this at all. Hey, over here. What's the problem? Problem? No, there's no problem. Quite the contrary. Well, there is a problem for me, but not for you. All right. <laughs> I ain't got time for no, this. No, no, wait! Give me a minute of your life. I might just change it forever. I'm sure you will have heard of me. Maximo Cristobal Valdespino, the renowned explorer. Can't say I have. There has been much written about me. I once had high tea with the Viceroy of India. I helped liberate South America. I've climbed mountains and swum across seas. I have had many women. I've spent the last three months hunting treasure on the American frontier. Beautiful country. Reminds me a lot of Almeria. But tomorrow I set sail for the island of Shikoku in the Japanese archipelago in search of the legendary Tokushima Sapphire. Well, 
Good for you. No, no, hold on. You see this map here? It was made by the Jackal Gang. They robbed banks all the way from here to California. Yeah, I know who the Jack Hall Gang are. Oh, them you have heard of, but me? Huh. Well, uh, rumor has it they buried gold somewhere in this area, but were killed before they could retrieve it. They created two maps to ensure it was well hidden. This is the first and should lead you to the second. You just need to follow the landmarks drawn here. Me? Yes. Unfortunately, I am out of time now, but I am prepared to sell it to you for the low price of... <gasps> Ten dollars. A trifling investment for a man such as you, given the potential returns. Mm. Uh, yeah. Why not? A very wise investment. I wish you the best of luck. Thanks, sir. And we're gonna find that treasure. For sure. Hmm. Well, I hope you ain't looking for gold, partner. I ain't seen so much as a fleck round here. <laughs> well, good luck to you. Hmm. Okay, weirdo. Okay, girl. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? Hey. Just... Hey. Where is that little Irish best? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the black water to see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Oh, well, we got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they wanna trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana. Then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Scaldings, boys, are moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles... Why don't you head up on the north side? And then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean and then we'll get ourselves lost. Good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. That seems like an interesting mission. Find the boat. The boat? Oh, okay. It's right in front of us. Follow me. It should be. See if we can track down this boat. Keep your eyes open. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCord. Some young mother, they're saying, Dutch murdered on the boat. You're too far ahead! Look. What are you doing? Come on. I don't know about that. I wasn't there. Bad day. And no money yet, it seems. I hope you know where that is, at least. Dutch and Hosea say they do, but it's trapped in the town. Down there. Reckon those might be our boys. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Keep your guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? 
If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. <laughs> Push up, come on. Okay, let's go then. Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. There's the boat. Are they gonna go on foot soon? Look. Oh, yeah. Get your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing with here. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skeldon's boys. But I hear they're a big crew, wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking them up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two okay. down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Okay, I got my shoddy here. We are ready. Well, we are gonna... Go silent mode? Maybe. We should do this quietly if we can. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Hunting. Throwing knives. Let's go. Sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Crouch down out of sight. Take out your knife. Wait. Okay. Okay, let's move down. Don't cross until he's got their attention. Hold up, he's doing his thing. Gentlemen, gentlemen, excuse me, dear brothers, my wife is taken ill, gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You She's take the one on the left. Very okay, come on, stay low. I, I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, mister. I, I can't, I can't, I, I'm having a fit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get after him. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. I think you have it. Okay. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Who's the 
guy you got them from? Is he alive still? Mm. We're gonna have to shoot our way out there! Ah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Bam. Shoo. Wait, 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 wait. Let me restart. Didn't want to do it this way, but. Oh my God. Can I Can I recover already? Where are they? Oh, there you are. Jesus. Sheesh. Bam, 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 bam. Let's go. Got your ways. Bam. Bam. We got one more. Where is he hiding? He's up there somewhere. Oh. away boy let me save Charles bam I right, we Gucci now quick come on let's get up there all right let's bounce that was hectic Oh no 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 My dead eye expired Let's go Here's Charles All good? Wouldn't go that far The camp's up this way Come on Charles you take the right I'll... Let me just Wait, wait. Oh, yeah, here we go. Okay. I'm gonna go crazy on him. Got your ass. Is he dead? I guess, yeah. Jesus Christ. Got your ass. Got your ass. Come on. Let me frame up. Bam! Should have took my rifle, man. Got your ways. Okay. Let's get Sean. I suppose I'll be owing you for this one. You know, 
You're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do I get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <coughs> Have I got stories for you? Yeah. I can't wait. <coughs> I imagine you all missed me a lot. But fear not, the joy's back in your lives now. Okay, let me see if these guys have everything, anything worth taking. Mm, not that I see anything. Extraordinary. Oh, let me check this. Check this little house here. Nope. I think I should be on my way out of here. Oh, Jesus. That was a fail. Come on, Horsky. The law is coming. The law is coming, sir. Hey, we got a, another stranger here. Oh, it's the photo guy. Nice. I don't know. Good morning. Oh. Hello. Why today, isn't it? Sure. What? Our country. I'm working on a project. Photography. Yeah, I guess that bit. <laughs> of course. Wildlife. That's my thing. Or that's what I want to be my thing. If I have to take another picture of a grumpy housefrau or pompous middle-class burger, I will feed myself to the lions. Stand here. Here? Just... There. Albert Mason. Arthur Morgan. Pleasure. I'm trying to find and capture images of our great predators before our greatest predators kill them all and stick them on some clubhouse wall. Good luck with that. Yes. Not the easiest. But, well, I love a challenge. The trick is to leave a big load of meat and relax and pray they don't mistake me for lunch. Oh, good heavens. My bag, that thing is robbing me. Oh, good heavens. Don't worry. That thing is... What? Sneaky one, too. Wildlife photographer. Jesus. Yo, coyotes can be dangerous sometimes. Where the hell? Oh, there he is. Come on! What the hell? Drop the bag. Um. Okay. Coming back. We got the bag without killing it. No, Gucci. 
Yo, isn't this the place where we just committed a massive murder? <laughs> Damn. The cops were just here. Well. I guess we're lucky. Oh, Arthur hasn't got any stamina in him, man. Damn. Oh, thank you, thank you, sir. Bag full of meat will tend to bring out the worst in the local population. You are a gentleman. The bag also had a lot of my supplies. You've saved me days. I'm can't thank you enough. I'm, I'm thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm. Uh, you take care, sir. I ain't the one trying to get myself eaten. I realize I am a fool. <laughs> Forgive me. And thank you very much once again. Okay, Albert Mason. Oh, that's not my horse. That's my horse key. We're gonna go save Micah. <laughs>